Now, I know I've spoken about this before on Facebook Live. I know I've written newsletters about this over the past year. But it seems to me that a lot of people still, a lot of agents, are still unaware uh, of the amount of professional indemnity they need to have. When I go into agencies, it's one of the things I often ask agents to show me uh, is their professional indemnity insurance policy. And uh, unfortunately, I keep seeing professional indemnity insurance policies for a million dollars. Obviously, they also have their public liability. They also have their workers' comp, all of those other insurances. The one that you must have, um, which relates to Section 22 of the Property Stock and Business Agents Act, so you're required to have professional indemnity insurance, uh, is it says it's one million. Let me read the exact words for you. I've got it here. Uh, the level of indemnity coverage of not less than one million dollars for any one claim, and not less than three million dollars in the aggregate. So, and that's what it needs to say on your policy, please. If you are an agency owner, go and check your policy. If you work in an agency, tell your boss to go and check their policy and make sure you've got $1 million for anyone claiming $3 million in the aggregate because that's what the Act requires you to have. It's what Commissioner's Guidelines have issued uh, for you to have. Uh, we've been This requirement has been around since March 2014. So, guys, it's not new. So, really, we need to be getting this right. So, uh, one, it protects you. Two, it's a compliance point. So uh, make sure that you check that. Also, just on a real side note to that professional indemnity, often it'll have a little clause in there that talks about your cyber insurance. What's covered in most policies for cyber insurance within your professional indemnity insurance uh, package is not enough if you get hacked. So guys, talk to your brokers, talk to them about separate cyber insurance. Uh, it's, it's so common these days. And you guys are targets because you hold people's names, you hold their details, you hold their bank accounts, and you hold bucket loads of money. So make sure you're protecting that on behalf of your client. Mm -hmm.